The winner of the 2016 Moody's Mega Math Challenge in scholarships of 20,000, St. John's School, Houston, Texas. Students from St. John's School in Houston, Texas were this year's Moody's Mega Math Challenge champions, taking home the top prize of $20,000 in scholarship money. In this year's challenge, teams used math modeling to explore how the sharing economy is impacting the use of automobiles. So this year's challenge problem was about uh, car sharing, which I had never heard of before. As we looked more into it, we realized that ride sharing is going to be an enormous thing in the very near future. It was supposed to talk about car sharing services and which ones might be best and optimal for a company to develop in certain different situations. The competition began in March when teams across the country raced against the clock to develop a solution in just 14 hours. It was a sprint. 14 hours of having the problem. You can give everyone the same problem and everyone will have different solutions. But they're all correct. A lot of times you just take a test or something in a lot of other competitions and you're done and you don't really have anything to show for it. But for this one, you know, you have a 20 page paper that you're actually proud of that looks really good. Panels of PhD level mathematicians reviewed more than a thousand papers to determine the six teams that advanced to the final event held at Moody's Corporation headquarters in New York. My favorite part of what I saw today was just being stunned by the poise of these students. How smooth their presentations were and how logical and organized and compelling. Anybody with creativity and ideas can try the challenge. You can approach these really difficult problems that don't seem to have an easy answer, like how popular is car sharing? I think math modeling is incredibly interesting. I think it's definitely opened my eyes to a whole new realm of professional ambitions. I'm going to remember working to make a presentation that cohesively explained in 15 minutes what we spent 14 hours working on.